like videos straight to the point. Let me know if I need to get this wig or not, girl. And that's what I'm gonna do for y'all, okay? This video is short and sweet. Straight out the package, on the head, styling, and then I'm gonna get my final thoughts. But let's get into it. Hi, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tiffany Nicole, and if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for showing up again. I know I have been missing. I know, but so much has happened in my life and I am back. And today we are doing a wig review. I saw this wig on Amazon. Actually, I saw it on a few different people that have done reviews. And I was like, all right, I'm going to try it. Because I've seen it on YouTube and I've seen it on TikTok. The wig was only 20 I'm looking at my order right here. It's $20.55. I think with tax, it came up to like $23 something. Um, I can't be exact because I ordered it with some other things. And it arrived today. And I was like, all right we're gonna do this review um it came in a pack like it looks just like this um it came with the wig caps it came with two i already put one on i do i really like this color i have not seen a wig cap this color before so i don't even know what color this is i usually have ones that are this beige color but we are about to see okay it is a curly wig um, I got it in 1B. I tend to stick to like natural black. Um, I don't do a lot of color anymore. I'm gonna say like within the past year, I've been doing like natural blacks. So, straight out of the pack, of course it comes with the hair net. But this is what it looks like. Let's go back. I love how bouncy the curls are. So, we're gonna see how it looks when I put this thing on. Let me go ahead and cut this part off or tear this tag off it comes with two combs right here in the front and then we have the adjustable strap at the nape of the neck all right let's see let's see how it fits put this thing on together um i have my mirror right here so i'm looking if i'm looking over here that's what i'm looking at see okay hold on because i don't want it to give me church mom <laughs> um of course i have to fluff it out so let me fluff this thing out because right now baby i belong in a service this, this is a clown wig um let's see because i don't want to mess it up i know i'm gonna have to cut the bangs initially we can hardly see it's way too long so need to get these together. So what I'm going to do. I really, really like these curls though. Um, The wig is really shiny. So I guess you could put like some baby powder or something to combat that. I'm going to get some scissors and I'm going to come right back and I'm going to cut this on camera. Okay, y'all gonna have to work with me. I'm at my sister's house and she does not have scissors, but I have <laughs> my little lash scissors. So we are about to see if we could cut this. And no curly hair. Hold on. I'd rather cut it too long first and then go back into it rather than cut it too short. We're about to see. Get some little scissors getting the job done. Okay. Get some little keepers. Cut those scissors. One thing I will say that I noticed, because I went and looked in a uh, big mirror, the bathroom mirror as well, this wig is like poofy right here. I don't know if, I don't know, up here it's too big. Let's see, we gotta fix this some more. I don't know how we could really Fix it up here. Let's see. If I could just move it to the side, you think? Okay, that looks a little bit better. I brush tried to brush it down to the sides. But yeah, like I was saying, it's like poofy right here. I even pulled it further down in the back and that poof is still there. 
and that's already at the edge of my hairline i will say that the fit of this cap is amazing like where the ear tabs go i usually have an issue where it's bumping right into my ear but it fits perfectly right here i love that about this um this part right here oh y'all if i could get this i might have to get like some bobby pins actually i'm gonna do that i'm gonna try to get some bobby pins i'm gonna stick it right here and a bobby pin right here and we we might be uh good once i do that let me go get those bobby pins and see if that works because as far as the cut i do like um where i cut it so my issue right now is just trying to get it to lay flatter in the top right now i don't know if that's just a comb issue as far as like combing it down or whether i need to pin it down but we are about to see together okay so i grabbed some bobby pins and i grabbed the comb and we are about to see pin this up let's see okay i like the way that's flat right there let me pin this side I don't think I have to do the back, but let's finish. Let me take out some of the curls. Let me see how that looks. I love that no matter how much you're fluffing it or running your fingers through it, that the curls still remain. You know what I mean? It's not getting uh, like really, really poofy. So the wig, the curls do have like hold, hold their own weight and they still remain bouncy i love that about it the curls are really really soft as well i don't know if i had mentioned that already but i do like this wig what do y'all think do you feel like it fits my face or is it like nah do i need bigger earrings like i don't know it does give me a 70s vibe <laughs> Um, but I really like this. Maybe like with a certain outfit, it'll really, really bring out the wig more or look better. Um, I don't think, let me see if I put it behind my ears. I'm just trying to figure out the best way to wear this to fit my face. Um, let me see. Put it behind my ears a little bit. Mm, nah, I don't like that. I like it big like this i like it me personally i think i will honestly get this i would i would probably go brown with this because i got this in uh 1b but it looks a lot darker than 1b 1b usually is so i might go with a two um i would even go up to a four and let me see what color they actually have in this so they have the natural black, they have the brown mixed with the black, um, they don't have the colors on here. Uh, they have a blonde, the blonde texture actually looks a little bit differently. They have a blonde and black, ooh, they have a red, but it, you know, the red head, so it's more of a orange. Then we have an actual orange and we have a burgundy. I'll be posting pictures of um, the colors I'm talking about. I'll be posting them right here so you can get an idea of what I'm talking about. But I really, really like the orange, the red. So that might be the one I have next. I'm gonna, I'm gonna order next and I'll definitely come back and show you guys what that looks like on my head. But yes, this is a short review, but I I really like it. I honestly do. I mean, and if you wanted the curls like smaller, you could go out. I feel like the wig is so full that you could go out like through the sections and cut curls out and it will still give that full look. It's not a heavy wig at all, but like I said, the curls have their own weight to it, if that makes sense. Um, so in like, as you fluff it out, it's not getting bigger and bigger. So I, I love that about this. It is so cute. And shake it for y'all. 
it is bouncy y'all i love this i should have had this a long time ago and honestly i've been seeing this but i was afraid to get it and i like it i really really like it it was simple easy to cut and i didn't have to do much to it two bobby pins cut the bang fluff it out and I'm good to go. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Let me know down in the comments what color do you think I should get. Um, like I said, I'm already looking at the red one. I really like that. But what color do you think I should get? And if you would get this wig, let me know. And what color would you get? Thank you for watching and see you next time. <laughs> Jika memang benar ini yang terjadi